All right, we're going to have a little look at this new technology from Unreal Engine. Uh, it's called the Meta Human Creator. We're going to look at the trailer, and then I'm going to open Unreal Engine, and we're going to we're going to we're going to test it. I don't know if we're going to test it properly, but we're going to see. Here we go. I've only seen a picture. I haven't seen a trailer. I yet. could be one of many. Yo. Or I could be the one. Je pourrais être architect. I could be an architect. Who guide? Those eyes look great. You create the narrative. I am meta human. I feel like I'm watching Detroit become human right here. Um, similar graphics, to be fair. But so we got a custom creation station here for characters right here. Look at all of these options we're going through already. Oh, I mean. I mean, this looks in in incredible already, doesn't it? The hair, the eyes, all the important parts. The skin quality and texture. Character creation just got so much easier. Change all the little bits and bobs as well. All the features, really make it your own. I can't get over when it zooms in on the eyes. They look more real than my eyes. Wow, even the way it reacts with the lightning. Not lightning, but the way it reacts with the lightning there is incredible as well. Oh! You know what's so good about this coming this year? Um, we're going to watch the other trailer as well. What, what I'm going to say is so good about this is the fact that literally, like, like say you're great at just, like, coding and, and, and putting together the game and you're good with the blueprints and stuff like that. But character creation is where you, you sort of fall short, you know? That's not really a thing. You've not got that artistic flair in that, that sense or whatever. For whatever reason, you know? People focus in on their skills and different things. Um, you will no longer have to sort of ask someone else to do this or pay someone else to do this. You can now use this meta-human character creator to create your characters in Unreal Engine. Uh, this is... I am a meta-human. The next generation of digital human powered by Unreal Engine. Yep. Meta humans are high fidelity digital characters created by you, the user, on our new content creation platform, Meta Human Creator. This is this is awesome. I am fully rigged. Fully rigged. Ready for animation and motion capture, allowing you to work in context. With everything running live in Unreal Engine, my motion works seamlessly. On other characters, I have eight levels of detail and have been tested on a wide range of Look at the emotion in the face, man. I have eight levels of detail and have been tested on a wide range of hardware platforms, from feature film to mobile. If you're interested in learning about my animation rig or high fidelity deformations, built on control rig, the new strand based hair system via the groom component, or how everything is tied together and animated in sequencer. Then have a look under the hood in this project. This is just a glimpse of things to come. Well, that's it. So they've rendered that. That's that's that, that, they've rendered that. I think I think that it's linked to the to you can you can link it to the, they've got like a face rig uh, technology that Unreal have put out. I can't. I, don't, I do not remember the name. Look, I don't make games or anything. Okay, like but they there's definitely a rig they've got set up. I've opened the project, right? Which means, basically, you'll be able to do the talking and stuff, and then you'll be able to match it to the model, and then cut scenes as well, and just general CGI stuff for, like, um, you know, filmmakers. People use Unreal for a lot of things. Uh, has just been incredibly advanced. Now, this is on my PC. My PC is pretty decent. We're going to have a look. I'm just going to press play. I just opened a project. Yeah, text to streaming, overpool, whatever. I'm going to click build quickly. Uh, lights, blah blah blah. The following levels are hidden. Yeah, whatever. Just just continue to build build it up. D I trust it. I'm not going to be able to look under the hood properly here because I do not know what I'm doing in Unreal Engine. I just like having it. I just like having it and trying to learn it bit by bit. But um, whatever, man. Build it. Just build it. Just bit. We're just gonna see. I just want to see how it runs in comparison to the render. Uh, I I, I just want to see how it runs. Uh, this is this is a mind blowing invention in my idea uh there's similar things you can get for unreal 
uh, but none to this quality. And this is actually made by them as well. So I'm, what we're going to do is I'm going to press play right here. Let's have a look. We're going to see. Give it a sec. I am a metahuman, the next generation of digital human powered by Unreal Engine. Metahumans are high fidelity digital. The way she's blinking and everything. The user on our new content creation platform, Metahuman Creator. They've pulled that straight from somebody talking to camera. Ready for animation and motion capture, allowing you to work in context. With everything running live in Unreal Engine, my motion works seamlessly on other characters. I have eight levels of detail and have been tested on a wide range of hardware platforms. It runs just as smooth. To mobile. If you're interested in learning about my animation rig or high fidelity deformations, built on control rig. Yeah, honestly, it has to, it has to be linked. Like, there's no way they've just animated that in. That's that's incredible. I don't know what I'm looking at with all of this stuff. Can I make it do something? I, I want to test it out. I don't know what I'm doing enough to test it out. But this is cool, man. Just look at this. Look at it when it just like just works e seamlessly. I am a metahuman. Seamlessly. The next generation of digital human powered by Unreal Engine. It's almost freaky. Are high fidelity. Now look, I'm not saying this is this is this this isn't like when I was going crazy about the when I thought everyone in the PS5 event was CGI. I, I still think everyone in that PS5 event was CGI. But it's just, that's another story for another day. But this is this is definitely current gen level right here. Um Maybe even next gen, I don't know. I am a but human. The next generation of digital humans. She said she's next gen. What about when they start their robo revolution? This is all very Detroit becomes human. But yeah, that's incredible. So you can just go in, you can create your character as 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 well as you like. You can put in as much time as you want to, making it look custom. You can just throw it straight in to all of this in Unreal, and then you can just have effects that just come out like this once you've once you've animated it all and put in the right sequence. I am a meta human. The next generation. The fact it's running like this on my PC is Android. tripping me out massively. Metahumans are high fidelity digital characters created by you, the user. I'm gonna try. I need to. I think the next video needs to be me trying to talk and getting it so it, it's me in this. I'm gonna do some research, people. Anyway, it was meant to just be a reaction to the actual, you know, technology trailer. But I thought, seeing as I've got Unreal, let's let's give it. A, let's open it up and see what we can do. Technology these days, man. Technology these days. Anyway, as always, like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Look after yourselves, look out for each other. And if you haven't seen the important announcement of video that I put out earlier, then go ahead and click that. I know it's two videos in one day, but you know what? Sometimes that happens, man. That was a quick video. This is a reaction. I know you love the reactions. A lot of people join from reactions. I want to know what you think is the coolest part about this. All of the... the I wish this was actually allowing us to mess around with the controls, but that's going to come later, you know? Um, this is just so you can see how it actually works and stuff, which, again, is pretty cool. You can click on all of this. Can I change? I wish I could change the hair and stuff. I really wish I understood this more. I don't know why I opened it. I just wanted to see, I had to see for myself, man. What have we got under animations? I keep getting distracted. Anyway.